in this video we are going to discuss about metrics roles and responsibilities in problem management so what are the metrics involved in problem management the metrics involved are number of incidents reduced by resolving the problems so number of incidents which are reduced by resolving the problems that means the incidents which reoccur are called problems so without with minimizing the incidents reoccurring we can decrease the problems also time needed to resolve problems so what is the average time needed to resolve the problem and updating the known error databases accordingly percentage of problems reoccurred so what is the percentage of problems that reoccurred and also the incidents which became problems also is considered in one of the metrics in problem management coming to well maintained non known error database so kedb so maintaining updating the known error database also is one of the key metrics in problem management so what role and responsibilities comes under problem management the main key role is of the problem manager who is the overall in charge of the problem management process and is also responsible for developing and maintaining the processes that means developing new processes and maintaining the existing processes assessing effectiveness of the process so after updating it or designing a new process after implementing it he will be updating it based on the assessment what he will be doing so that he can increase the effectiveness managing the problem support staff so a problem manager has a problem support staff and he'll be managing that problem support staff with the new processes as well as giving them new inputs providing mis to the management so he will be providing mis reports to the management so that they can report it to client for further information allocating resources to the supporting activities so for support team activities he is the person who will be allocating resources so who are the problem support teams who support problem manager the support groups are the support group personnel who help the problem manager in reactive and proactive problem management through identifying and recording the problems advising incident management team about the workaround and also they will be fixing this workarounds also identifying trends and potential sources of the problems submitting request for changes to prevent the occurrences prevent the replication of the problems to multiple systems so if any virus got attacked and became major problem which is reoccurring again and again so they prevent the replication of the same problem to other machines also by using by using the resources as well as supporting the problem manager the support personnel will be very helpful in playing the key role and responsibility in the problem management